Like and subscribe on the way in the door, people. Uh, today I want to talk about, I'm sure you all have heard, but we're going to play it for you. Uh, Tim Grover talking about the GOAT debate between Michael Jordan and LeBron James. Let's check it out. This thing has only happened four times in the history of the NBA. In the history of the NBA. Four times. Where one player has won the scoring title, won the regular season, MVP, was first team defensive player, led the playoffs in scoring, and won the MVP in the finals. All five things. It's only happened four times in the NBA. You know who the four players who do it were? Jordan, 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 Jordan. So, um, I don't think it's much to be added to that. Uh, if, you, if you've seen the whole clip, you know he goes on to uh, ask how many people in the audience owns a pair of Jordans and seems like just about everybody stands up. He asks how many owns LeBron and I don't know, maybe one or two people stood up. And uh, some will argue the shoes actually have nothing to do with his skills on the court. But I beg to differ. So in this video, I want to talk about how greatness inspires greatness. Michael Jordan was so great as soon as he came into the league. And we're not just talking about his talent. We're talking about his work, work ethic. And we're talking about his will to win on the court. That is what inspired the events that happened for Michael Jordan. It inspired the um, Bulls organization to get the right pieces in place for this guy who is determined to win. To get the right coaches, the right managers, the right players. So it, his greatness inspired greatness around him. It inspired Tim Grover to, because if you, if you know the story of Tim Grover, and don't quote me on this, but I'm just kind of paraphrasing what happened. Is in the beginning, him and Michael hadn't really worked out um, payment or, or what that situation was going to be like. Tim Grover just stepped out on a limb and said, hey, me working with this guy is going to pay off in the long run. And we see... It, it, Think about this. It seems like everybody associated with Michael Jordan turned out to be one of the greatest, right? You got Phil Jackson, who turned out to be one of the greatest coaches. You got Tim Grover, who turned out to be one of the a legendary sports trainer. Even people like Jerry Krause, you know, he made some great picks. So Michael Jordan's greatness inspired other greatness. He inspired Nike to break the rules, to, to make a shoe for an athlete. And, you know, some about in the, in the beginning, um, there, there were limited colors that they were supposed to be. But Nike said, it, it, it's worth paying that fine. We're breaking the rules. And so everything associated with Jordan turns up greatness. Um, even people who make content about Jordan, 
first and foremost, The Last Dance. One of the greatest sports documentaries ever. I probably watched it at least 10 times when it first came out. And I still go back and watch it. Uh, But if you've seen some of these other highlight reels of Jordan, the historic Bulls mixtape, Voyager, those highlight reels are above and beyond any other player that you can find. And it's not just because Jordan is so great. It's because he inspired greatness. Like the people who took the time to make and edit those videos made some legendary videos because they were inspired by how Michael Jordan played. And if you uh, have watched a lot of these reaction videos from some of the younger generation reacting to Jordan for the first time, uh, some common things that you will hear is, what am I watching? Because they cannot believe their eyes. And this guy must be an alien. Like, they, they cannot believe their eyes. So, yeah. To me, greatness inspires greatness. And the greatest inspires the greatest. So, it's like everything associated with Jordan comes out great. Now, for before any of you bring it up, yes, he did not have a good go as an owner. But everything that came out of his basketball career, out of him playing basketball, everything that came from that was nothing but greatness, and it inspired greatness. Anyway, let me know what y'all think about that in the comments. Uh, I'll catch you next time. All right.